<laughs> the aftermath of all the snow last night. P.S. Rome, New York. Thank you very much for plowing this. Well, snow blowing it. Uh, this is the path on Chestnut Street, and it's very busy street. A lot of traffic, especially in the morning and that early evening. And uh, they keep it clear so people can walk and stay off the streets. Thank you very much. And if you ever walk on it when there's snow, you can notice all the footprints. And I mean, a lot of people actually walk on this. Maybe not today or tomorrow, but Wednesday when it warms up, there'll be a lot of people on it. Unless you're daring like me and you venture out into the cold. Got a hazy sun. the county home hospital long time ago and uh, uh shit i'll walk over to it i really like these trees the problem is is that rome new york the city always has a habit of cutting down perfectly good trees never understood that but anyways that's the cemetery County home, hospital, grave sites. And of course, uh, all the tombstones, I believe, were moved. And I hope all the bodies were moved too, but you never know. <laughs> they will say the bodies were moved, but the bodies could very well still be right under our feet. Get really read it, can you? A lot of people, though. I don't know, I've never seen any ghosts coming in here, so, or leaving it. Oh, look at those clouds. I love the winter. I just don't like the sub-zero temperatures that accompany it. It's like uh, being on a episode of Life Below Zero. Except have you ever noticed that on Life Below Zero, these people, the TV show will say that it's like 27 below zero and the people on the episode aren't wearing any hat, no gloves. They're wearing regular shoes, not insulated. And all they have on is like a flannel shirt and a sweater. I mean, really? 27 below zero? I don't care how tough you are. You're not gonna be that lightly dressed. <laughs> Especially when it's below zero. <laughs> 